Hey everyone, Canadian Trucker here. January 28th, 2021. We're in a town called Porter, Indiana at a TA truck stop. Today we got Popeyes. Popeyes has been around in the States for as long as I've ever been trucking down here in Canada. It's just starting to sort of sneak up here and there. And uh, yeah, lineups, they're crazy. I don't know. We'll see what the big hype is. I've had it a few times before. Today I got a chicken sandwich though, and I've never had that, and apparently it's the best. You can talk to my boy Cody. He insists Popeye's is hands down the best chicken place there is, and I strongly disagree with him, but we're gonna see how things go. We got a chicken burger. Big old stack of napkins. Side order of mac and cheese. A quarter pound of shrimp. They give me five sporks, three blackened ranch sauces, and three butters for the biscuit that they, uh, I think they forgot, unless, unless it's in here. Nope, forgot my biscuit. <sighs> what do you do? Strike one, Popeyes. <clears throat> Actually, strike one was the guy at the counter. Um, so everybody knows life's a little bit tough trying to talk through masks and trying to understand somebody especially with a heavy accent and I have no idea where this guy was from like American 100% but uh, you know maybe Arkansas I'm not sure but um, yeah when I was ordering everything was good and then I asked for popcorn shrimp and he said that's going to be uh, what do they call that that's made to order and I said, okay. And he stared at me and I'm staring back. And finally I'm like, I don't know what you want. And he's like, it's made to order. I'm like, yeah, you said that. I'm, that's fine. He's like, well, if you're in a hurry, you won't want to wait. I'm like, it's fine. I'm, that's why I said it's fine. He's like, okay. And waited like five minutes, wasn't a big deal. Very nice guy, just don't know what that was about. <sighs> okay. crispy chicken sandwich now I asked for no pickle and no mayo <coughs> why would you ever put pickle on a chicken burger that uh, that kind of blows my mind but I don't we got a hair that's all right it's like a cat hair probably fine I think that's the first hair maybe we've had on this channel yeah just a piece of chicken between a bun That's why we got. Uh, that's why we got the ranch. Yeah, why would you put pickles on a chicken sandwich? I mean, mayo is not my favorite thing. I'll, I'll, you know, I will eat it, but uh, when you got ranch, that's what I go for. So we'll take a bite of our sandwich before I put the ranch on it. It's hot. It's fresh. It's actually a decent sized sandwich. So obviously that's pretty boring. Um, there's nothing on it. I wanted to get the spicy chicken, but it looked like the only difference between the spicy and the classic or whatever was the sauce, which I didn't want to begin with. So I don't know if the, anybody know if the spicy chicken sandwich actually the chicken's spicy itself? I don't know, but nothing wrong with that. Grab our blackened ranch. Oh, yeah. Blackened ranch. They have regular ranch too, which I think is what I meant to get. This one's probably a little bit spicy, but this burger actually needs spicy. Like Wendy's spicy chicken every time. Let's try it with the ranch. that brightens it up nothing wrong with that chicken sandwich at all now just uh, you know needed some flavor <clears throat> which I know flavor is not my thing but sometimes you need it but yeah do that as far as being the best no not even close 
I would say, uh, you know, with a, a Wendy's spicy chicken being a 10, and that's a Canadian Wendy's spicy chicken being a 10, and say uh, McDonald's, yeah, what do you call that? McChicken being, I don't know, it's not even the worst. That's somewhere in the middle anyway. Try our mac and cheese. I, uh, <clears throat> I'm sure I've had mac and cheese from here, but I, I can't really remember the last time I had it. So this will be sort of a new thing. <clears throat> it doesn't look promising, that's for sure. Just kind of, uh, you know, no sign of any real cheese in there whatsoever. Actually, it smells really good. Mm. You know, it's all right. <clears throat> it's on the lower end for sure of mac and cheese. Like probably a, you know, a two out of 10. Cracker Barrel, that's where you get some damn good mac and cheese. I was there a while back and yeah. That's uh, probably the best one I've had at a restaurant. There we are. Hopefully something worked for a thumbnail, but we got iced tea. Put about yay much sweet tea and then filled her up with regular so it's got some flavor of tea. Otherwise it's just sugar water if you get sweet tea. wrong with that now typically <clears throat> typically if I was coming to Popeyes you know um, I used to always get their chicken fingers I've tried their black and chicken fingers it's kind of all right but nothing exciting popcorn shrimp that's what my go-to is if I wasn't doing a video I would have only gotten popcorn shrimp I probably would have got two of these actually. And they're just little, little small battered shrimps. You know? Popcorn shrimp. I love those things. Never once have I had bad ones. I kind of want to go and complain they were cold. Just to be a dick. <clears throat> But I'm not gonna do that today because I don't want to walk back in there. But yeah, that was uh, that was Popeyes. No biscuit. I think that was strike two. The guy was strike one. Yeah, only two strikes. So you know what? I'll come back get this again. This burger is nothing. Nothing to say it's the best in the world the way people boast. I mean, hype is hype, and some people will eat this simply because somebody else said it was good. Don't listen to what other people say, especially with food. Make your own opinion on that. But it's all right. I'm going to finish this up. Thanks for coming, everybody. See you next time.